Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. This is Climbing the Ladder, episode two of our first season with our new club in Ballatown FC. So last uh, episode we uh, played the New Saints. I played Jan Duno off camera. We had a 1-1 draw, got a goal from Declan McDonald, a penalty in the 37th minute. And then a 1-0 win. Matthew Thomas scored the game winner. Uh, and that was before they had a man sent off in the 85th minute. So uh, a win and a draw after uh, our early stumble against top of the table with, uh, with no staff, right? So let's take a look. We've got a little bit of staff going on now. So uh, we have hired Neil Graham as our assistant coach. Uh, he is 43 years old. He is... Where's he from? He's from Wales. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. He's, he's decent. I am having a little bit of, what do they call it? Buyer's remorse uh, for leaving the job. Um, but, uh, you know, the last job. But I, I think it was the right thing to do. Uh, we had been there long enough. It was, and it's supposed to be a journeyman. And honestly, I think, as, as we mentioned, I just think we needed to do this to see if it does anything. Because if it doesn't, then it's time to end this save and start start our new save for the rest of FM20. Uh, is what it is. Uh, but anyway, by the way, if you guys have any suggestions uh, for a type of save or a challenge type of save or uh, anything like that, let me know in the comments moving forward. And, uh, you know, because we will end this journeyman at some point. And we'll transition into something else. Um, typically, I do two separate saves uh, during a year. And so, uh, you know, at some point, we will transition over uh, to a different save. So if you've got some ideas, throw them out there, and we'll see if anything sticks, anything gets my attention. Big thing is, it has to be something I want to do. Uh, so, you know, if I don't do it, doesn't mean I didn't appreciate the input. Just, you know, I, it's got to be something I want to do, but I'm always open to suggestions. By the way, let me pull this up. Check this out. I got this achievement, Childhood Dream. Now, this is not on this save. This is on my, uh, I've mentioned that I do play a personal save. And uh, it, it's a journeyman, always a journeyman. And uh, I got the Leeds job. So this was funny and just kind of off the off the beaten path. But it is football manager related. So I was with, uh, I had gotten a job at Sunderland. And we were doing well. Uh, we, had, we had climbed to sixth in the table. We were in the six and seven range in the championship. When I took them over, when they hired me from my previous job, they had actually been relegated. They were going to be relegated from the championship to League One. So I took the job with the agreement that I would take over at the end of the season. Had a really good year with the club I was at, but it was time for a change. Sunderland was a nice step up. So I took the job, took them down, you know, took over when they were in League One, and we ended up winning the league. It was a little tough. We got off to a rocky start. Uh, I think we had six draws in our first seven matches and and we ended up starting off like in fifth or sixth position and a couple of teams in there were just doing really well so we we clinched league one we we won silverware the next to last match of the season so it was a long haul uh we got back to the championship and i was i was doing well we were around sixth or seventh in the table and I got a job offer, a job interview request from Bristol City. I wasn't looking for a job. I wasn't applying for jobs. Uh, Bristol was around 12th in the table, underperforming. They were, you know, Sunderland was supposed to be mid-table, and we were right on the cusp of playoffs. Bristol was supposed to be a playoff team, and they were mid-table. So they, uh, I looked, uh, you know, they had sacked their manager. They interviewed me. And I thought I was going to get the job. I wasn't listed as the favorite, but I was thinking I was going to get the job. Slavin Bilic got the job. And I was like, really? So he's a, he's the West Brom manager currently in real life. So I went and looked at him, and guess where he was managing at? He was at Leeds, who were also a mid-table championship club. So 
I went, well, that's interesting. So I immediately through, you know, declared interest in the job, uh, applied for the job, declared interest, the whole nine yards. Uh, they interviewed me and literally uh, within three days offered me the position. And so, I, but I was freaked out when I got the achievement. Only 2.6% of all football manager players worldwide have ever gotten this achievement to coach their the club they have as their favorite club in their profile that's astounding i was stunned by that anyway back to back to business at hand so yeah we got an assistant coach uh we hired a coach uh who can who can kind of do the job so we've got some staff there uh let's see schedule wise we talked about we got uh we got three points uh there in the premier league so that has uh kept us out of relegation currently uh, we are on 20 points we're not going to do much better so remember today is not the end of the season uh, here in the welsh premier league we actually split uh, into two halves so uh looks like with eight that's six points i i, I suppose cardiff and, and druids could swap out I don't think Colwyn Bay or Jan Dunno are going to have the goals to catch Cardiff. Um, but that's one spot still up for grabs. And then we split. So we'll only be playing in, in this second group. So we should do okay. Uh, so anyway, we'll see. Let's get to today's match. Uh, let's see. So we're playing Connus Quay. Connus Key. I, I don't know how to pronounce that word. I'm thinking it's Key. Q-U-A-Y. I'm thinking that's key. Kana's key. It looks like Quay. But what do I know? I'm sure one of you will tell me. But let's get to it. We are gonna, uh, we're gonna. we underdogs, but we are going to play our 4-4-2 tactic. All right. I have added the offsides trap back in. I've been playing with that in my solo league. We've been having a lot of success. Uh, so we'll see. Still getting used to the team. I mean, I've only played a couple of games with them. Three, I think, to be precise. The interesting thing is the... Um, are we going to do anything? Somebody shot, not for us. Oh, there it is. Uh, so they're playing a 4-3-3. Um, so, yeah, it's interesting that the offsides trap is being very successful. Uh, with Sunderland, I actually had a 20-match win streak uh, down in League One uh, when we made our run to the top of the table. All right, Roberts. All right, this is us. We're in white. Bennett. Uh, it's deflected, but it goes out. It should be a corner for us here. Rainy day. Uh, you think they have a? They can make some more pawns for the because it looks like there's a bunch of uh, identical, like quintuplets in the stands over here. Crossed in. No, oh, that's that's not good. Oh, Penris, he made the run. Declan McDonald can't get there, and he is now out of position. Cocking is in on the run. Knocked away by Watson. Good save. Good save. It's my new drinking mug. And yes, it's a big one. I live in Texas. Everything's bigger in Texas. <laughs> All right, let's tell them to get creative. They're inspired. All right, we're three shots, one on target. All right, a foul. Crossed in. Oh, Scott Burton, his first goal of the season. He beats Bennett to the header. His first ever goal. What got us key? Damn it. I am a little leery. About the offsides trap, especially here in the early going. 
All right, they've put three shots up. We haven't had any. All right, they have been playing well. I got to change my mindset. I mean, I'm not, I'm not at uh, our old club, Carl Scrona, anymore. All right, let's uh, show some passion. And I'm not at Leeds, so. Whoa, off the woodwork. Everybody's looking pretty fit. All right, Wilson into the box. Oh, taken down. That was a dirty play in the box. Who's stepping up for it here? Come on. Jones. Oh, brilliant. Couldn't even tell you what spot he plays. Gareth Jones. He's our left winger. There you go. Six starts, two relief appearances. But he's in my starting 11, at least this match. We'll take that to get on the board. All right, let me, let me sub off Bennett for his yellow, plus he's tired. All right, Woods or John? I'm going to say Woods is what my gut's telling me. All right, we'll go with that. Show some passion. All right, Penrith lays it short to Paul Freeman. He takes a, oh, whoa, what, a, how was he off sides? How is he off sides? Oh, that's bullshit. They, it, you saw that it said he was off sides. No, he was not. And neither one of those guys were involved in the play. Uh-oh. Gardner steps over and sails it. Okay, the keeper got a hand on that. All right. Uh, Tipton for Roberts, maybe. All right. Lee Jones and Gordon All. Who do I want up there? All right. He's a pretty solid finisher. No Pace. He's got pace, but no finishing. Ugh. All right, so Jones for Jones for Tipton and Robert swaps out. Oh, don't give up a goal here. Oh, what a save by Watson. Yeah, I don't even know when the when a transfer window is in this league. I've never coached in Wales before, so I'm looking forward to it. But definitely, definitely a step down. Good save. I thought both of those guys were off sides, but it looks like our right back kept them on. All right, let's tighten up. Oh, they're frustrated. I'll take the point. I will take the point. We evened it up here. We need to get better at our shooting, possession. I'm seeing stuff in the tactic that I'm liking. So, yeah, we're going to tell them it was excellent. That's going to help morale, if nothing else. All right. Well, we got another point. Uh, Airbus got a win, so we're even, unfortunately. C Colwyn Bay lost. And... Druids lost, so we're only a point behind them. We're actually only two points behind Jan, Jan Dudno, uh, so it's going well. All right, we'll be right back for the final match of this first half of the season and see what our draw looks like and then figure out where we're going to come back. See you guys in a second. All right, we are back. So this is the final table for the Premier League for the first half. Today we're playing Lido. In the fourth round of the Welsh Cup, they do expect us to reach the quarterfinals, which might be the next round. I couldn't tell you. Stages. 
Yes, the quarterfinals are the next round. So if we win this, we will have met expectations. So that'll be good. So let's get to it. Oh, we do have one bit of transfer, a couple of bits of transfer news. Massimiliano Massa uh, is leaving the club end of the season and will be going to Laduno, uh, 19 year old. God, he's really good. But there's, uh, you know, with the finances, we've got a lot of players on, uh, you know, we're going to have to probably eat, some, get rid of some players. Uh, also, Osaji Jimo went to Yandundo on loan through the end of the season. Uh, he is our one of our starting center backs, so that's a loss. But again, we had him uh, transfer listed. Um so this gets his salary off the books. So don't know exactly how much that helps us. We're still 100000 over budget. So we're going to have to shave back immensely, immensely. So anyway, uh, let's see. Match preview. We are, we are favorites. They're in good form, however. All right. Um, McDonald, Bennett. All right, what's Bennett look like? No hitting. So we've got the same issue. People, you know, people from here cannot head the ball. Yes, because he is Welsh. So we'll want to focus on English center backs because <laughs> they can hit the ball. Uh, let's see. You can see how many of our guys are listed. Uh, our keepers listed. Our wing backs listed. Central defenders listed. I don't think I listed any of these guys, did I? I might have. I don't remember doing that. I might want to come and pull these guys off the loan list here in a minute. Uh, well, I'll do it after the match. And at least force them to make me an offer, you know? But, I mean, we're so far upside down. I'm going to have to be very, very frugal for a while. Probably not re-sign a couple of these guys. All right, I'm going to continue on with cautious, uh, you know, because even when we're favored, we're doing well with this tactic. Uh, my lead save, even you know, even when I'm favored, we're winning sometimes three, four nil. Oh, uh, Penrith steals it. Oh, that was not good, dude. That was not good. You need to shoot less. Oh, Wilson pounces. He's on the run up the left flank. Lays it off. Wilkes back to Massa. Thomas off the woodwork. Oh, that was an opportunity to take a lead. Get creative. Well, I don't know if that was headed out. Roberts... All right, Wilkes comes back, plays it to the keeper. Ball comes back out to midfield. Boy, they are flying to the ball, aren't they? Oh, there's a nice deep ball to Wilkes. To the touchline, lays it back to Wilson. Back to Massa. All right, he brings it. Well, he was going to go that line. Massa plays it in. Ken tipped in with the volley, his eighth of the season. Good goal. Some nice buildup. I like that. That looks good, boys. We're going to give him a little bit of praise here if I can get it to him. No? All right. Only 17 minutes in. Don't get complacent. Oh, he stomped in it. Well, Wilkes pounces again. Boy, that guy is losing the ball left and right today. Hit an earlier cross, maybe. Oh, taken down in the box. That's brutal. Turner's got to be sent off. No penalty? No foul. Wow. All right. And this is Declan McDonald. Puts it inside the right post. All right. That's a good goal by Declan McDonald. 2-0 advantage. Hey, penalties, actual shots on goal. We will take it. Bennett. Oh, good save by Hudson. 
kudos to you, Mr. Goalkeeper. Got to give some credit there. Another highlight, Wilson, Wilkes in the box. Oh, that was horrific. He skied that one. Wow. Another one right to the keeper. Okay, quit throwing to Thomas. Just a suggestion. <laughs> oh, that's going to be a sending off. Yes, Tipton, thank you for nothing. All right, um, right, let's see. Mid-right. So we can move Roberts back here. We can move you here. All right, and I'm going to put you there. We're going to go that route. <laughs> if y'all can hear my son snoring, I apologize. <laughs> That's pretty funny, though. He had a rough day. Midterms were today, so he's uh he was exhausted, he said. All right, 11 shots to four. I don't think they threatened us after, you know, even after the sending off. All right, play it calm. He plays it way back to Watson. All right, there's Wilson. Wilson over the top. Wilkes on a nice run. Oh, he, he cut it inside the keeper. What a goal. That was nice. 3 0. Even a man down. That was a good run. All right, they play it short. Okay, header out. Wilkes on the counter. He's got no. no <laughs> Who the? Come on, Thomas. All right, you know what? You got a one finishing. You're horrible. You know what? You have less pace, but you've got better finishing. I mean, he's playing well. Let's see if he can do a better job up top. I mean, I at least want to see people running onto the ball. You know, if, if my strike... Oh, look at that. <laughs> he stopped. Oh, my God. There's a shot. Oh, Thomas actually looked good there. A deft finish. Two goals in a three-minute span. That is nice. That'll So he'll score, and then he'll go off. That'll be good. Four nil. Let's give him some praise. Oh, that fired him up. The boss said something nice. Uh oh, injury. Pernice Penris thigh. Let's bring. All right, so we'll go there. All righty. Just see it out, boys. We're already cautious. We're not doing anything crazy. Oh, he bent it right off the woodwork. Kicked out of play. We'll take the corner. So we'll at least hit expectations here. That'll help with the board. Pinged out to Jones. Oh, that was a horrible finish by Roberts. I actually get a lot of, you know, I get a good number of goals from my wingers if they can. Well, McDonald puts that one over. If they can get, you know, somewhere right on the edge of the box when they shoot. Ryan scored, you know, with Carl Scrona, Ryan, the mid, mid center mid, scored uh, quite a few goals. Excellent effort. A lot of good green numbers there. Some over at eight. 
That's sweet. All right, we're going to call that a success. Let's see. All right, we win Penrith two to four weeks. Ouch. All right, $43,000. We get Cardiff Met Uni in the quarters. Tipped in, suspended. That was a straight red, yes. I think. Yep, straight red. Wanted to double check that. And we are going to uh, find two weeks' wages. Two assists, five tackles. So we'll tell him his defensive work was good. I wonder if we're going to have the the draw here at any close time. I don't I don't think so. I don't know when it is. Um Premier League playoff. What is that? We're not in the playoffs. Unless it's the relegation playoffs. Pontypridd? Did I just miss that team? Oh, they were the one in the basement. Okay, that's why I haven't played them yet. Remember, we just took this club over, so I, I haven't seen. So these, okay. So cool. Um, outside of the loss to the Saints, I mean, we're pulling points. Five points from three league matches. That could be worse, most definitely. Now that we're going to be playing clubs at the bottom, you know, in the bottom with us, let's go ahead and let's come back for Colwyn and Cardiff in the quarterfinals. And then we'll probably jump up to, well, do I want Colwyn twice? Probably not. Colwyn and Airbus. Let's go ahead and do Cardiff and Pontypridd here. That'll give us three or four games here. And then that'll give us Colwyn and Airbus to end the season. So two more matches. We can get out of this season, kind of get, get into the offseason, kind of evaluate things, see what's going on. And um, we'll go from there. Well, guys, hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. Uh, I have seen an uptick in the views. We actually hit double digits on one episode, and I think another episode got up to nine, so we're getting close. So much appreciated for all that. Um, from my heart, guys, I do appreciate all the support. And, you know, I don't, you know, as I always say, I don't ask you guys for money. I just ask you to make a comment and talk to me every once in a while. Uh, and, and hit the like button. That's, that's all I ask for. So much appreciated. You guys are the best and we'll talk to you. Hopefully we can win a few matches here before you see me again. Take care. Bye.